Hey love bugs, it's your girl Disasters Beauty coming back with the voiceover. So this unit was sent to me by Zuri Sis. It is in the style Chill and it is in the color FFT Blonde. This unit has your standard two columns in the front, one column in the back with adjustable straps. And they stated that this unit was kind of supposed to give that, um, the illusion that it had been straight combed in the front where you could see the, the front part of it, the hairline better. So that is kind of like the highlight of this particular unit. Um, right here, I'm just doing the same stuff that I always do. I did not got to be glued all the way around, just mainly focused in the front of this unit. And right here, I'm just applying my bronzer to the front of it. Underneath it, I did use my Sally Hansen Airbrush Legs. You guys know that's a staple for me. And then I'm gonna apply my Tarte Shape Tape just to highlight that part in space and everything else is pretty much history. So if you are interested in watching me finish style this video and give you guys a full review on it, then please continue to watch. And I will see you love bucks in the outro. Bye. <laughs> Nobody will say I got on too much bronzer. That we on a day that I ain't got on no bronzer. And be like, sis, you got on too much bronzer. When child, I done piled on by eight bronzers today, okay? I am a bronzer fanatic. Like, oh my God, it gives me life. Like, who don't want to be bronzed, honey, okay? Like, oh God. Uh, okay, y'all. So, I am obviously done styling this wig. And this is what I came up with. Before I get into how I feel about this wig and all of that good stuff, I want to first tell you guys who sent me this wig, where it's from, blah, 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 all the specs and details about it, and then we will get into the review portion of this video, and that is going to be like how I feel and stuff. I do my videos like this for those of you who do not like want, even care about my thoughts. You just kind of want, you saw the thumbnail, you saw the wig, you want to know some details about it, you want to see what it looked like on and you're done, okay? You don't care about the actual review of the wig. That's why I do this. So, we're going to start with that, and then we will get into my review. So, if you are interested, then please continue to watch. So, this unit was sent to me by Zuri Sis. Shout out to Zuri Sis for sending me this unit. If I'm not mistaken, this unit is not yet available. I think it won't actually be available. It says the end of October. Today that I am filming this unit is my sister's birthday. Shout out to my sister. Happy birthday, boo. It is September the 27th. Um, but it says it won't be available to the end of October. Now, that being said, they do send units to certain companies. I noticed that wig types always seem to have these units uh, before that time. So you may have already seen this unit and then they'll, um, after that, those are sold out then they will wait till probably like the end of october to send the rest but there are a few companies that will be getting this unit before they are actually released okay so it says that but you may still be able to find it on certain sites um now this unit is called like i said it's by Zeresis, and it is called chill which i really like i like that because you know i'm very chill okay your girl is very chill this this unit is basically named after me okay this could have been a signature unit as well <laughs> but it's called chill it's gonna it's byd lace h chill in the color ftt fft blonde and um it says preset frontal hairline five inches tight part lace front high heat uh safe up to 400 degrees so you can apply heat to this unit up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and on the back of it it just have your washing and care instructions and this is what the unit looks like in the front I wish I knew what color old girl is wearing because that color is bomb on her like I really want I really like that color for fall as well I feel like it's a really yeah I think she has on the F 
FT Amber. And I did get another unit from Zerisa's in that particular color. But this is what it looks like on the stock card. And I just feel like that is a really pretty um, fall color. Like, oh, it's just a fall color, okay? And this is what it looks like on the back of it. I just think that's really, really cute. Now, they also sent me this card, and I want to read this card to you because they sent it, and it was attached kind of to the box. I don't know if you saw that in the intro portion of this video, but I do want to kind of get into it, this little card right here. And it just says, preset frontal hairline. Hairline appears as if it was styled with a hot comb. And by that, I don't know if you've watched anybody's video where they kind of like apply the hot comb, and they kind of give you that up effect right there. It just kind of gives you that added volume. I read that from here because I would have never remembered what it was called. <laughs> but it says, uh, it appears as if it was styled with a hot comb, resulting in a hair parted at the front with added volume. And it, it is styled this way to make it easier to care for baby hair. Lace front, 5 inch center hand tied part, 24 inches in length, and face frame and style that slims the face. And child, your girl has a round face. Okay, so I love anything that's going to slim this face, child. And I do feel like it gives that effect. Like, that is why we like layers, like, because I feel like without layers, it doesn't frame your face, it can make a unit look dull, less full, all of that, plus, it can, it, it, it doesn't frame your face, it doesn't give it a slimming if, uh, if effect. Child, is it effect or effect, girl, get it out, okay? <laughs> but I feel like when it does have layers like this, like that whole fair faucet swag, you know what I'm saying, it just gives your face a more slimming effect. And I do have a very round face, so I love that, child. I love it. Now, sis, as far as shedding and tangling with this wig, honey, let me go ahead and give you the sugar honey iced tea. She tangles, okay? <laughs> she is tangly. So I do want you guys to keep that in mind. Now, she's not as tangly as, what was that wig that I reviewed by Sensational? Whatever that wig was, it's not as tangly as that, but the unit is still a tangly wig. Like, I was running my fingers through it, and it, they're getting, it's getting caught. You know what I mean? Like, so, I want you to keep that in mind. Now, this unit is 24 inches long, okay? It's synthetic. It's 24 inches long, and it has some curls to it. So, I do expect some tangles, but it is a little more tangly than, than I care for. It, it still has some tangles. Now, um, shedding now, I don't... Haven't noticed any shedding okay like i haven't noticed any so it may not be shedding whatsoever if it has i just haven't seen it so right now i haven't noticed any shedding so that's always a plus and yeah that is pretty much it as far as the specs and stuff on this unit now it does come with your standard two cones in the front one comb in the back with adjustable straps and it is just a parted unit like you can't part this unit anywhere else but i do feel like you could shift it if you want to but we will get more into that later on in the review portion of this video so yeah that is that's pretty much it so i'm gonna give you guys a quick lint check and then we will get into the review portion of this video now mind you it says 24 inches in length i am 5'4 and this is where this unit come to me now child don't mind my good okay she's on a diet she's gonna lose it <laughs> but this is where it comes to me it's pretty long on me i am not the tallest I am not the tallest person in the world. Like I said, I am 5'4", so it may look different on you. It may be shorter or longer on you depending on your height, but I am 5'4". I also want to mention that this wig is big head friendly, which I was pleasantly surprised about because a lot of my units from Zerisis are not. Okay, she's not. I don't know why, but usually <laughs> a lot of times they are not big head friendly. So this unit was big head friendly, and I was really, really happy about that. So shout out to you, Zerisis, for this unit being big head friendly. Okay. Now, I do want to say I don't feel like it's so big head friendly that it won't fit my small head, girls. Like, my head wasn't swimming in it, and I do have a medium cap size. So I feel like it's just a good overall unit. I feel like either can wear it. Now, unless your head is super, super small, like Journey Brown, like my baby, then maybe not. But if you do just have like, you know, a regular small head, I feel like you will still be able to wear it and it'll still be a look. And yeah. So now we can get in the review portion of this video. Now, if you are interested in that, if you want to know my thoughts, if you want to know all of that, then please continue to watch. So, y'all, for me, I feel like this is a whole freaking vibe, okay? This is a whole look. Like, let me zoom out some so you guys can get into this vibe. Like, like, honey. 
Is she, is she, is she, is she Beyonce? Is that Beyonce? Oh, is that, is that Beyonce, honey? Like, this unit makes me kind of, it's just giving me that Beyonce vibe, okay? Beyonce and Fair Fawcett type vibes. Like, I think this unit is super, super cute. Like, I wasn't expecting really to like it as much as I do like it. Now, hold on now, you're trying to make me look like a buffalo. I want to look like Beyonce, not a buffalo. Like, get your life together now. Your life together okay <laughs> um i like this unit i like the whole concept of this unit i was really really excited when they sent it to me and they you know asked if i wanted to review it and i saw it and i was like oh oh honey that's a look okay it's a whole look to me i love it i love the layering of this wig i like the slimming factor of this unit i think this unit is really really nice and i think it's cool that they they thought of that whole uh hot comb effect of this wig because i'm always trying to get that effect and i never can so i like that they did that and it really does have that type of vibe where it was really really easy to get to my baby hairs i am a baby hair stand okay i know a lot of you guys do not like baby hairs it's not your cup of tea blah 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 and with these units they do come so long that you don't actually have to style the baby hairs if you don't want to okay your hairline is still gonna look really really nice they do always come with customizable baby hairs. So if you don't wear baby hairs, then you ain't got to do nothing with them because they're already pre-styled, blah, blah. I mean, not pre-styled. They're already super long. And it's up to you to style it to frame your face. If you don't want to wear them whatsoever, if that's just not your thing, honey, then you don't have to. But if you do, then um, you may see them and you're like, oh, child, them baby hairs too long. They are customizable. They make them long for a reason because some people like really long, super thick uh, baby hairs. And some people like for their baby hairs to be super thin and more natural. And some people are kind of in the middle, child. I don't know. It depends on who you talk to, whether or not I'm in the middle. I may be either in the middle or extra, okay? <laughs> I'm definitely not the naturalist, most natural person on earth. I mean, look at me, child look at me my husband always like to joke and say when i get home i'll take off my wig my contacts my eyelashes my makeup and my heck sometimes maybe even my nails because these are press ons and he'd be like chrissy if she is your kneecaps real honey okay is your kneecaps real <laughs> but yeah i'm not the most natural person but if you are and you want your unit to look more natural and you don't like all those baby hairs you don't have to do all that okay that, if, if that's not your cup of tea you ain't got to do all that i'm just saying so anyways yeah i um i just feel like this unit is a whole vibe i like the hairline of it and i'm gonna zoom in and let you guys look at this hairline so this is what the hairline looks like and i think it has a really really nice hairline and initially i didn't even do anything to the sides because i don't feel like the sides are as natural as the front of it only because this unit is meant to be styled like this. So I don't think they really focused on the sides of the unit. So it's not the entire hairline. But that portion that is being shown I think looks really, really nice. All I did was apply underneath this wig cap my Sally Hansen airbrush legs. And I am using yet another color child. I have to go with whatever they got in the store, okay? I can't never remember to order it from Amazon. So I have to go with whatever they have in the store. And this one is Tan Glow. And you guys may or may not know, child. Every time I order or get uh, the Sally Hansen airbrush legs, I'm like, oh, this this is the one for me, okay? This is the one for me. <laughs> like, before it was the deep glow, and I was like, yep, this is it. I don't have to bother. I don't have to get any more. This is it. So, I got the tan glow, and, like, for the last few wig reviews, I have been using the tan glow, and I feel like this is me, okay? This, this is what she's going to use from now on. Child, it might be something else next week. But right now, this is what I am feeling. So that's what I put underneath just to make the hairline, you know, look more like me. Not me. To match my skin tone more. And I uh, applied this, um, this LA Pro Girl Concealer. I applied that to the parting space and I set that with my Fenty Bronzer. And I also applied my Fenty Bronzer just along the hairline to, you know, give it that that more natural effect because child, she got on so much bronzer. Child, child, I'm a bronzer fanatic. Okay, don't judge me. So I wanted to put some bronzer on the hairline just because I had put on so much bronzer. Child, she was a different color. So yeah, that's what I did to the hairline. And I think the hairline looks really, really nice. Um, really to me, the only con about this unit is the fact that it's tangly. 
and I feel like you should kind of expect a synthetic curly long unit to tangle it may tangle a little bit more than most but I do feel like you should kind of expect it the good thing about these units is the curl pattern and if you're not good at cutting they'll still look good once you cut them and I feel like at a, after a certain time you're gonna have to cut this wig like if you buy it and you're wearing it especially if you're wearing it a lot you're gonna have to eventually cut it only because it's gonna tangle on you so I do want to mention that I don't want that to deter you from getting the wig because I do still feel like the wig is worth it I feel like the wig is a whole entire vibe now as far as this hump spacing and all that up there I feel like you can apply some mousse or you get a tiki bed head stick or something to just kind of lay that down I am not kind of mad at the effect like but child I'm southern okay we are about big hair like I ain't we ain't about Texas big hair but we do like big hair so it ain't bothering me but if it's an issue for you like you like uh-uh, i don't like i don't like that mm -mm, she don't like that then you can get some mousse or something like that and lay it down or um i almost said your doggone uh <laughs> hot calm but i don't know you want to do that you might melt it so anyways yeah that is pretty much all i have to say about this week. so i'm gonna give you guys a full 360 and we can wrap this thing all the way up so this is the unit in the front this is it on the left side This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. As I stated, I do feel like this unit is an entire vibe. I think it is really, really nice. Um, I would completely recommend you guys copying it. Not copying. Copping it. Now, if I do, like I said, Jury Sis told me it will not be available for purchase until the end of October. I will still check on wig types just to see if it's available on there. If it is, I will have a direct link to it down there uh, in the description box. If you don't see a link, that means I could not find the wig. And maybe one of my good sis down below will let us know in the comments if they have it or they know somewhere that it's available. Because that's usually how I find out for real, okay? That's really how I found out that this wig is available. Any wig is available. It's from y'all. So, yeah. Just check the description box and check my comments. Because somebody may comment that they know a site that has it and I just didn't find it. So, yeah, do that, and we're pretty much done. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, something you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, this is what are you doing with your life? Click the subscribe button. And if you're not already following me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and Facebook. I'm held to Missy on Snapchat, and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love bugs, next time. Bye.